hey what's up hiding welcome to my youtube channel in this series we're going to be looking at how to build this um grocery shopping app using flutter and laravel as a backend all right so basically the last video or the last series i made that was about creating a forum with laravel and flutter so that it, it was very very engaging people liked the video very well so i decided to you know what let's go ahead and make another type of video with laravel and flutter but this time around, we're going to be building on this particular grocery application. We're going to be using Laravel as our backend, um, backend um, framework that we're going to be using. All right. So, yeah. Without further ado, let's just get started. So the first thing we want to do is what set up our project. So to set up our project, first thing we want to do is head over to Laravel.com. We're going to make use of Laravel.com and also make sure you have Flutter installed already. So what I want to do initially is I want to open up my terminal. Then I'm going to see the into my documents. All right. Mm -hmm. Set into my documents. Then I have a folder called my YouTube. All right. So instead of my YouTube, I'm going to create a folder. I'm going to call it um, let's say GC app, basically grocery app. I'm going to set into this GC app again. All right, so this is what I'm going to create on my project. So I'm going to create um, basically uh, the Laravel and the Flutter application in this folder so I can access them all together. And I can, you know, if I want to push them to my GitHub, I can push them all together. What you can do is head over to um, GitHub. All right, um, sorry, head over to the documentation part. Then let's go ahead and click the first Laravel application. Let's copy this command and paste this. We can go ahead and call this gc api so we're going to create our api in this place so um don't mind this error i'm having i was trying to install something then it wasn't successful that was why i keep having the error but initially if you should run that you should be having this from the beginning so you have to make sure you have internet connection because you're going to be requiring internet to install the application all right so let's wait for this to just finish up all right so our project has been set up successfully uh, we can go ahead and clear this and next thing I want to do is I'm um, creating another project which is with Flutter by doing Flutter create So as a Flutter create, what are we going to create? We're going to create the GC app itself So this is going to create, uh, create the Flutter application itself for us Running Flutter Popkit So this is not supposed to take um, time Yeah, which is done already So what I want to do is the GC um, API Alright so I'm going to JC API and before that I can go ahead and do um wait. I can go ahead and go back. Let's see CD go back. Sorry. I want to do um git init. So just initialize the repository here. I'm going to go ahead and call um CD API. Then I'm going to open this up in Visual Studio Code. So on the first part, we're going to be starting with um our api so we're going to start by building our api all right so our project is um up and run it as expected oh okay good all right so we can go ahead and test it by doing php artisan serve okay it's going to run our server for us as you can see which is running our ports um 8000 so let's go I'm just going to open this up okay very good all right so once that is done what i want to do is i'm sorry i'm just going to copy this so what i want to do is um head over to the Laravel documentation again we want to set up our api uh for the api we're going to be using something we call sanctum which is something i've used a lot on my channel so you're I suppose you know what Sanctum is by now. So I'm going to use Sanctum. I'm going to copy this. Now in our terminal, you can close this server. Go ahead and paste it. Paste it right there. Copy this. And paste. Sorry. Why? Why can't I paste? I'm trying to paste. I can't paste. Alright, so let's just copy this. And paste. Okay, good. A clear enter then this is going to what require Laravel Sanctum in our what application basically it's going to install Laravel Sanctum in our application and you know remember um composer acts as no package manager for Node.js also 
okay very good so what we're gonna do is you can copy this and you can go ahead and paste this and click enter all right so once that is done the last thing we need to do is our um code editor which has to do good but any code editor you're using go ahead and open kernel dot um dot php and we need to uncomment this particular part here all right go. so we are basically done in the next two we are going to work in on um, basically the authentication system all right before we even do that let's see if this has authentication system or we'll just come up with it um all right so it turns out there's no notification system all right so basically we can just work with um we can start with basically all right we we the way it is now i think what we are going to do is we are going, basically going to have an admin that just basically uploads to this then um uh, anyone can just head over add to cut and check out i think that is actually very good all right so the next two are going to start working on that we'll see you next time peace